Hi guys. Hi guys and welcome back to another video. From a treehouse to a palace. Wow. Amazulu. Beautiful. Palace. Is this? Oh my god. If you guys could only see what we are looking at. This place is mind blowing. We're going to actually show you our room tour before we mess it up. So let's do that first. Then we will give you. This is the entrance of this beautiful. So you must know what's coming up on the inside. Yep. We'll tell you in a bit. Bye. So, guys, welcome to the Amazulu Palace. It's a five-star guest house. And wow. Just look at this. Look at me. So guys, we have just joined our first affiliate and that is through Expedia. It is a uh, bookings service kind of like bookings.com but uh american based and if you like what you're seeing at the amazulu african palace then please click the link in the description box and hope you enjoy this tour with us
needed to call you before I messed up this beautiful room. And who do we have here? Welcome to my African palace suite. Sure. This place is incredible. Okay, so let's give you the quick room tour. It's not a first impressions room tour, so you're not seeing our bread taken away. So we are on this side with this long vanity. This is the door. Granite. It even has a an adapter. That's very real. It's a cupboard for you to store your stuff. These windows. They do open, but... Into stained glass. Yeah. This is for privacy, so... A working sink. A working sink. We're not wasting water. And this is the coffee and tea setup. And in here, a fridge. King size bed. You'll do the bed test in a bit. And then I just want to show you that beautiful piece of artwork right next to you. Oh, wow. Stunning, huh? It's on both sides. And in the middle of that artwork is... TV on a little... TV. Like a, it's like a cart. It's beautiful. Oh, the furniture, everything here matches, so... But it's actually in the shape of a Let me show you that. photographic. So ignore my, my setup here already. But most people do come for more than one night, unlike us. So you've got ample space to keep your stuff. A little butler tray for your remotes. The aircon remote has the aircon operating at the moment and for your TV and DSTV. Now, I'm going to leave you to do the bathroom tour because you've not seen it yet. So, I don't know what to say. Welcome to this king-size bathroom. I have never seen a bathroom this size in any hotel I've stayed in. Wow. You are never going to see a bathroom this size anywhere. Like, I thought it was a tub at a sink, and I was like, where's the toilet? And then I walked down. Okay. A full walk-in shower. Okay, okay. Sure. And then obviously, the mode. Okay, toilet. With the peacock feathers. Wow. Yeah. Did you expect that size? Nope. And then we also got a balcony room. And just so you guys know, it's not as if we booked like the most expensive room. It's a palace. So guys, just to set you into the picture, even though we're catching the sun there, that's the behind this property is the banks of the gorge of the Transkluf Nature Reserve. So it's also spectacular views just off this behind this property and that's a nature reserve along here forestry of the palace. So guys, this is the bed test. Creaky but, and springy, but soft. Time for the 
Ice cold. Oh. Do we have yeah? Okay. This place is I don't know what to explain. I've never been to a palace before like this. I've been to palaces in India, but this is an African palace. The artwork, the architecture, the building. The decor that they put on the insides of this place is on another level. This ice cold Coke Zero is going down well right now. It's quite hot on the outside, hot and dry. Boom. Okay guys, we're going for a quick walk around. He's very tired. Whoa. His staycation has begun. We're ordering in today. Yep. And resting. Okay, so let's go. Lead the way. He said it's high cats. Mm. So pretty. So this fence is a border with the conservancy. That's Transgrove Nature Reserve. I think we're going to meet any animal friends. Well, apparently from time to time you see the diker and the zebras and so on here. Okay. We'll leave them alone. It's a green pool. <laughs> We're at the top there. An outdoor area. Okay, guys, to bry. Out. How's that view, guys? Check it out. That's it's the gorge. That's the gorge. Crown School of Don't Nature fall. Reserve. Don't fall. I would say it's a must for. I can't say everyone, but whoever can, within their means, are able to do it. Instead of booking the like regular. Five star hotels. Though. Going to the Hiltons mm. and the uh, Beverly Hills and so on. Doesn't compare to this. Yeah. This is something else. And as you can see, we had two very different adventures. One was in a tree house. <laughs> yeah. And one is in a palace. And to be honest, if you're looking for a staycation and you just want to chill, it's not, there's no spa and stuff like that. There might be. I don't know. I don't, don't ask. know. <laughs> but it's just. Sometimes you need to be in a treehouse to shut down without technology. And then sometimes you want the luxury of a massive room and we get to experience it both. Yeah, soak up in the hot tub. <laughs> we'll catch you for supper. I think the sun is setting there, but definitely in the morning I'm going to show you the view of this place. We're going to order in and show you the delivery options that are here. And then we'll eat in the communal area. Don't come here with heels. It is suspended, so it is okay. Here I go. No heels. <laughs> So the night lighting here in the palace is completely different. 
And what we're doing is we're collecting food. So all the delivery services work here. So this is, we've just collected our food. And as you can see, the palace has a completely different vibe at night. The atmosphere has transformed. This was once someone's stunning home, right? Probably. <laughs> Look at these. In the day, there was no light. This is all lit up now. Every piece of artwork here has been carefully curated by the owner. The story of which you will learn when you get here. Okay, are we going to the dinner area? What did you get there for us? This is Chinese food. Eh? Yeah, <laughs> we're not doing anything too extravagant. Is it chow mein? We're doing a chop suey. A chop suey? Chicken chop suey and some sushi. Okay. So we're about to eat some yummy food. Let's check what we got. It's not much to show off like how we normally do. I'm going to show it anyways. Mr. D. Mr. Delivery. Mr. D. Soy sauce. Chop six. Ooh. Here's a lot of sushi. Mm. Ooh, and I can smell that chow mein. Chop suey? Chicken chop suey. So it's from Tommy Sushi. We're gonna eat this and then probably see if we can catch any night footage, but we're probably gonna see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. And welcome back to another morning. It's another morning. It's the next morning at African Palace. We're just about five minutes away from checkout. And we just want to give you an overview of this five-star guest house. Beauty. It's absolutely mind-blowing, amazing, something that you, I can't even say you dream of things like this. Yeah. It is. Perfect getaway if you're looking for, especially... I would say it's more along, along the lines of a romantic getaway. It's a staycation. There's nothing to do yeah. on the property itself except chill explore. out, explore, check the pool out. There's a viewing area. Yeah. Go up in the balconies, see the gorge overlooking the Kranzklof uh, Nature Reserve. And just admire and take it all in what's happening on the inside. I'm sure you would have seen in the videos. If you're a nature enthusiast, there's there's a lot of trails nearby. There's a lot of things to do in the Kloof area itself. But also, like, today, Saturday morning, you can go to Shangweni Market. Everything's a drive away. So if you're coming from another province and you're staying here, there's enough to do without having to go into Durban City. Yeah. So, But in terms of this place, I will always speak about bathrooms. The shower was like a massage. Literally. It was beautiful. Yeah. It was like so... It was powerful shower I've ever experienced but yeah i'm i'm not gonna lie this place took my breath away and we've stayed in five star places before yeah so we had two very different experiences i hope you enjoyed it with us we went from a tree house to a palace literally and wow. both were unique both has their, their beauty in its own way I enjoyed the footage i actually caught some got some shots this morning to see the upper highway area at its best. Yeah, so I hope you enjoy it. And don't forget to hit us up in the comments. Let us know what you think about the treehouse, about the palace, and yeah, everything else. There's lots of hidden gems here in uh, Durban. Yeah. So, yeah, we just need to go and find it. And it's affordable. I hope we helped you find somewhere beautiful to stay without having to drive 
too much out of the city. Or if you're visiting from somewhere else, then consider booking a place like this. There is breakfast available. Uh, you can order yes. in the morning. It's 200 rands per person for breakfast. Mm. So it's a plated breakfast, but five-star treatment. So we can't speak for that, but that is available. But as you would have seen last night, we ordered our own food and sat in the dining area. So you can do that as well. Or you can even like order stuff and sit. But sure. in your, yeah, you have it. Uh, you have your own seat. Balcony here. tables that's on the outside with a little nature walk. Yeah. There. <laughs> There's a lot of farm stalls and all of that in this area where you're yeah. going to get freshly baked stuff. So, yeah, you know what? This place ticks all the boxes. So if you have a thinking of a having a five star experience, yes, not a retrospect, uh, not on like the beach, a hotel, beach, you know, that kind of stuff. This is something else. Yeah, but it's it's good. It's, you just get to chill and in, and enjoy nature here as well. And the palace, which is forgetting uh, like even the accommodation part of it, is outstanding. You can book functions. You can. Oh, what beautiful photo shoots it would make. But yes. we loved it. Hope you enjoyed it with us. Yeah. We are off to a farm now. That video will be coming up soon. So we'll catch you in a bit. And just giving you the last beautiful scenes. Our one night staycation. At the African palace. This is another place that's here. We didn't see this yesterday. And that's where we stayed. That's the entrance right there. Serene morning, but as you can see, this area is not open. Ah, oh, what a viewing deck if it was. Probably under some maintenance. Okay, now we're actually leaving. Closed. Through the majestic doors. Fairly well, African Palace. <laughs> He's waving to the building, not me. <sighs> Tranquility at its best. I said no more trouble See how we day our life so stable Sitting together on a big round table Chatting and laughing so comfortable This no vision we go keep on the struggle Since less and less this no be tussle Because my God don't make me able Yeah, 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 yeah It don't make you able to Wait for your time oh. You better wait for your time oh. Wait for the right time Oh, life not turned right